Hey everybody out there, Ryan Dixon here. Just here um, to give an update about how I'm feeling about the recent changes on Earth with the uh, coronavirus spreading. That's what the mainstream media is talking about a lot is um, different areas getting shut down, this virus spreading, affecting a lot of people. And uh, my main advice that I want to give people is there are forces that work through the heavens to protect us so if you're a person that's still in a positive vibe you're still praying and you believe in the afterlife you're not going to have as much fear about clinging to your life here on earth as um my perception is we're almost in a type of um like a purgatory or like a middle earth a middle ground between the higher and lower realms and um when we pass on here we become integrated into the higher consciousness which is spoke about in a lot of um, ancient texts and spiritual um, belief systems basically is thought of as heaven so there's no disease there's no war there's no sickness uh, there's no suffering in these higher realms that are more god-based consciousness so we're here in separation from that for a short time just to learn lessons and to um, expand more and create but um, there's an amnesia on earth whereas many people have forgotten that we are part of this oneness consciousness so sometimes chaotic events have to occur for people to tune into this um, idea of oneness and this level of love that's in their hearts. So I just figured I'd broadcast this message. It's just a short message to help inspire people to be more positive. If you believe in prayer, I'd like to explain a little bit about what I believe prayer is. Um, thoughts are energy and uh, you could have ego-based thoughts or you could have um, source consciousness-based thoughts or God consciousness thoughts where you're tuning into your higher self and using your brain as like a receiver for information from your higher self to manifest here in this physical world. So a lot of people um, think of prayer as just a dialogue with the man in the sky, but really it's a dialogue with um, your own aspect of this God consciousness in a higher realm. And um, a lot of people are cut off from this, but when you're tuned into this, um, you're completely protected and you have a lot of faith because you know that there's a divine plan that's unfolding and we're only pawns for the bigger picture to unfold so people on earth are meant to spread fear some people and some people are meant to spread love and peace and calm gentle energy I'm one of those people that chooses through free will of duality to express kindness and gentle energy um, because this is like my soul essence and I believe this is um, energy that's deeply rooted in the core of what my soul truly is and that's that um, love energy that's beyond all so I'm just using my crystal now to um, ask the higher energies to help manifest healing for all people that are affected by the coronavirus to help guide the path of the earth into um, a better place after this situation um, basically resolves itself. So a lot of people are seeing that um, the finances are crumbling, which is a good thing because in order to cure a problem, you have to hit it at the roots so it doesn't grow back like a weed. And the financial enslavement of humanity has been a big thing for the past several hundred years. So it's interesting to see it dissolving now during this time. We might be um, initiated into kind of like a golden age where people are supporting each other and there's universal abundance. So um, if anybody has any concerns, any anxiety, any type of grief, anything that they want to heal during this time, um, feel free to reach out to me. I'm going to be probably um, staying away from public spaces just to avoid uh, sp spreading this potential energy but I'm always open to video call healings and chats um, just to help people out um, out of the service of my own heart 
and um, this is what I'm dedicated to doing so just thought I would speak a little bit about all this I'm not trying to buy into any of the fear-mongering any of the conspiracy theory stuff I'm just um, simply here shining my soul shining my light shining my opinion shining my healing and uh, amplifying my thoughts and intentions into prayers to help heal the earth and heal this um, chaos that's um, being perpetuated through the news and the media and the elite um, I'd like to just bless everyone now and then say farewell and we'll see you guys all again